Hello, tennis, tennis lovers, and welcome to another episode of um, Tennis on your favorite platform, Fozan um, Sports. And um, in this episode, I'm going to look at the new tennis rankings that is out. The new rankings is out, and um, already there are some movements on the table, and others also uh, moving down the table. Yeah, down the table. So the latest live WTA ranking last update was um, Tuesday, September 14, 2021. At uh, two forty six, the time that uh, the data at that time that I'm looking at, and I don't think it has changed up to this time that I'm uh, filming this um, episode. And so I will critically uh, look at some performers on the um, the rankings, and um, most notably, Emma Raducanu has um, jumped from one fiftieth rank position to the twenty second position with two thousand five hundred and seventy one points. Wow, wow, that win has catapulted her upwards, and then quite fantastic there and then some um, notable um, names there let's look at the full rankings there we still have Ashley Bati as number one with 10,075 points there yeah and then the, um, the Australian yeah the Belarusian Arena Zabalenka controversial Arena, Arena Zabalenka who smashed her racket during her game against um, uh, Leila uh, Andy Fernandez is uh, still second yeah it's still second you know uh, the rating, the uh, points tally is that you have to accumulate and build up points. And so it's difficult. The reason why it's difficult to dethrone Arena Zabalenka from the second seed is that uh, she's been participating in all these most ATP tours. Most of these ATP tours, the Southern and Western tours, the um, uh, just uh, uh, so many tours, Abu Dhabi, Qatar, Dubai. And so, so many of these ATP tours she is participating. And though the ATP um tall uh, points uh, build up is less lesser as compared to the grand slams the fact that he, she's been participating means she remains consistent to consolidate her position in the second spot and so not surprising at all she's still second it will be difficult for uh, she's steering away from the third rank which is carolina please cover now third rank carolina please cover the czech republic tennis player there with uh, 5,317 points. That Arena Zabalenka, anyway, has 7,720 points. You see the gap. Ashley Barty, 10,000 and something. Zabalenka, 7,720. And then um, Karolina Pliskova is having 5,315. So you see, Elena Svetolina is number four. The Ukrainian, um, the wife of um, Gar Monfils, is having 4,860 points there. And then we also have um, Barbara Krejikova, the champion for the Roland Garros, the French Open there, she is having 4,668. She is having 4,668 points tally there so far, uh, placing at, at number five. And then number six is controversial Iga Swantek. She tweeted in an unfortunate manner against, uh, uh, to congratulate uh, 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 Daniel Medvedev by uh, pulling the legs of Novak Djokovic. I don't know the kind of relationship that she has with Novak Djokovic for her to have tweeted in that manner anyway. Maybe they have some uh, informal relationship, which I'm yet uh, to know anyway. Somebody should update me if uh, he has that knowledge of that relationship between them for her to have tweeted in such, such a manner. So she's having 4,571 at number six. And then we have Sofia Kenin. I, I can't go through all the lists, you know, it's, it's too big a uh, list. Uh, we have Sof Sofia Kenin. Uh, USA 4,413 at number seven, and then Naomi Osaka, the Japanese based in the United States, uh, Miami, Florida, and Naomi Osaka 23rd, 4,326. Gabine Muguruta, the Sp uh, Spanish, Spanish, having 4,135 at line in the ninth seed, and then Petra Kivitova, the tenth seed, Czech Republic 4,060 points. That these are the first ten. I wouldn't want to uh, waste us in, you know. Um, you just know them, it's uh, accessible uh, in most of these ATP life ranking websites, and so I wouldn't want to bore you, but I'm trying to uh, uh, analyze some statistics relating to the rankings, not necessarily uh, wanting to go through them, because we wouldn't have the necessary time to do that. Belinda Benchich is um, uh, the 11th rank, the Swiss with um, 3,820 points. Maria Sakurai, the 12th uh, seed there. We have um, Anastasia Pavlyshenkova, Simona Halep. Simona Halep, wow, dropping to 14 from fourth position. Wow, wow, dropping. And Osaka also dropped. Mind you, Osaka also dropped currently at number uh, uh, eight or so. Currently eight. She dropped from 
fourth rank position there. And so Angelic Keba is 15. Um, Elena Ribakina, that Kazakhstani. Wow, wow, she's um, added. She moved uh, one places upwards, and then Simona Halep has moved three places downwards, and then um, Maria Sakarai has moved uh, from uh, uh, prior to the tournament from 17 to now 12. Yeah, Ons Jaber has also moved from um, 18 to yeah 17 now. Ellis Martins has moved down uh, by two two places. Kori Coco Golf is now 19th, of course. Bianca and Vesco, my Bianca. Uh, this, uh, you know, some, you know, I have favorite tennis players, of course. Bianca and Vesco, Iga Schwantek, um, maybe Ons Jabel, and then the Emma Raducanu. <laughs> so, Emma Raducanu, Naomi Osaka, uh, you see, so I have my favorites there. But, um, so Kori Golf, 19. Coco Golf, too, is my, one of my favorite. Bianca, 20. Jennifer Brady, Emma Raducanu, number 22. Jessica Pegrila, so many on and on and on. Leila Fernandez is at 28th position. Yeah, and so this uh, is exciting uh, times for um, the game of tennis, and uh, we hope to um, those players who want to consolidate themselves in the ATP tours that are coming up, uh, leading to Australian Open earlier. Um, 2022 and so the uh, see the grand slam um end uh, has been fantastic for some and it's been disappointment for others too uh, in uh, another episode i will take time to go through the uh, male rankings in which novak djokovic is still um uh, at on top of the rankings there um before i run out of this program if it happens to be your first time of joining me on this um uh, edition please do well to hit the subscribe button touch the notification bell Share the program to as many viewers as possible. Smash the like button if you enjoy the presentation. Comment to agree or disagree with me uh, in the comment box down below. And then share the program to as many viewers. Thank you very much for uh, engaging me in this special edition. Cheers. I love you. Bye-bye. My subscribers and my viewers, I love you so, 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 so much. With one love. Bye-bye.